Hello family, once again there's a delicious recipe to share on Queen Nava TV so please subscribe and like this video. My name is Queen Nava, your number one chef. This is my Ghanaian delicious homemade pizza. As you can see, here are my ingredients. I have ginger, garlic and spice for my meats, vegetable oil, my pizza dough is ready and vegetables and cheese for my toppings. Mmm, delicious already. Set the fire, pour some oil into the pan, put your chopped onions into the hot oil, stir it for a while. Now you can add your fresh meat. Yes. Keep stirring. You want your onions to enter every part of this beautiful beef. Yummy. <laughs> you see the color now? It's almost cooked. So you add your chopped garlic and ginger to spice it up. Stir it. Now you can add a little pinch of salt. Yes, I love a lot of salt. So yeah, forgive me. <laughs> Now you can add just a cube of the Onga Maggi cube. And then you stir it for a while. Make sure that your meat is delicious. This adds up to the toppings of your pizza. Stir. Keep stirring until you have the texture that you want. Then you can add some water to boil. It's best if you cover it up for a while so that the meat will be soft now let's move to our pizza pan all we need to do is oil it up make sure the oil is in every corner of your pizza pan then you come back to your beautiful perfect dough knead it up a little bit okay knead it up a little bit for the texture that you want you can cut it into two since i have two pizza pans you know and I don't want it to be too huge. I would want it to spread out and look perfect. <laughs> yes, I'm getting the right texture for my pizza dough. And I love this texture. <laughs> it's not too thick and it's not too thin. So you get that, that kind of crispy crust at the end of the day. Brown. Yes, now you can spread the love. Spread the love. <laughs> And then, since I do not have the right tool for this, I decided to use that brush. Yes. Just so, I mean, we have a little bit of holes in there to spread our stew on. Some people would use normal tomato sauce, but I prefer stew, especially vegetable stew that's already made. Because it has pepper already in it, it will add some nice taste to my pizza. Now, it's the base, so it's best if we spread the love. <laughs> I'm talking about the cheese. Mozzarella cheese is the best. You can get that in any of the malts in Accra here. Spread that onto the stew and your beautiful pizza dough. Add all the toppings that you want. Now our meat is ready, greasy, soft, and delicious. Mm. Oh, yes. We spread the love onto the cheese. Then... You add some more toppings as much as you want you can add some mushrooms any sort i mean any form of vegetables that you find juicy and very very healthy or nutritious for you and your family i am a tomato person i love tomatoes i love onions so those are the basic vegetables that i will be using in my toppings so you seal it up with more and more cheese there is nothing like a delicious cheesy pizza yes that is how my house loves our pizza set fire to the oven put in your pizza put it on low heat you don't want to brown or burn your pizza it's best if you have a brownish i love a brownish and crispy our pizza is ready after about you know 20 minutes on low heat oh my god it looks so delicious. 
and my pizza is ready this is a homemade Ghanaian homemade delicious pizza you might not have all the the, the i mean all the ingredients that people do at the restaurants you might not have all the tools but you can always improvise look at me using a sauce <laughs> a sauce to cut my pizza look at a triangle and that cheese oh my god it's mouth watering thank you guys for watching please subscribe and leave a comment below thank you